What's happening, everybody? And welcome back to Abacab Classic Gaming, where we encourage that if you're going to game, keep it classic. What's happening, man? Let's see who is this in here. It's Richard Lyon. What's going on, bro? Well, this is actually going to be a slow change of pace. Which, let me move all this stuff out of the way and bring up what I am attempting to show y'all today. So what I am showing y'all today is how to get Tecmo Super Bowl and play it for yourself. Now, you're going to want to type in on the Google search bar, tecmobowl.org, and it should come up as this one here. We'll go ahead and select that. So how you doing, Richard? So once you get into here, you don't have to sign up or anything, although it is it would be pretty badass if you did. You know what I mean? But you should come to techmobile.org where you will see this logo right here. All right. You want to go over to downloads. And then the first thing you're going to want to do is get the emulator. All right. This is the thing that actually plays the games. So what you're going to want to do is go down here to emulators. And you are going to want to select Brutopia slash Nestopia PC if you are running Windows. Okay. If you are running Macintosh, this is the one that you hit right here. Now, I do not have a Macintosh, so I will not be showing you how to do that. Now, here it will show you when it's been updated, which March 23rd of 2021 is when this one was, uh, when this one was updated. Go ahead and select the name. And then you will click download this file. Now it should come up here in your downloads. It'll come up uh, up underneath uh, Broodtopia. But depending on which unzipping program you have, whether you have WinZip, WinRAR, that's going to be what you want to associate this file with to extract it. Now I've already extracted it. I've already got everything that I need out of this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to get the game now. You go back to downloads right here. Now, you want to go over to the side here where it says techmobile.org official yearly ROMs. Or you could also go NFL by year. Now, I normally go here to where I can get the most updated ROM that I can possibly get. But as we can see, they have not updated it yet here. So where I'm actually playing Tecmo Super Bowl 2024, where I downloaded it, was NFL by year. Where's 23, 21, 20, 22? Where's 24? Let me see if I can find it. SNES, Tecmo Bowl, NES. This is the original Tecmo Bowl. You can get that here at Tecmo Bowl, NES under downloads. This is the original Tecmo Bowl, like the original. You know what I'm saying? But that's not what we're looking for. Now, there is also others, like other ROMs you can get on here. I'll let you sort through the website, but techmobowl.org is where you want to go to go get the emulator and then the ROM itself. So we'll go to TechMobile official ROM and we'll see if we can find a 2024. Here it is right here. Tecmo Super Bowl 2024. It was updated on September 10th of this year. You'll select the name and then you'll go to download this file. Now this is the revision 2. You hit and download the file, and then once you get in, all right, and I'm going to go ahead and show you all how to do this right quick. This is the emulator right here. This is what it will look like once you extract it. You can extract it to your desktop. I extract it over into downloads, and then I just make a um, a, a quick reference, a, de a, desktop, uh, a desktop link. A shortcut, desktop shortcut, and put it on my desktop. Now, you'll double-click that. 
and then that brings up the emulator itself. Now, if you have downloaded the ROM, more than likely, if you did not select a folder for it to be under, it'll be under your downloads folder. You'll go over here to file and you'll hit open. Okay, now my games happen to be all in their own uh, folder, which as you can see, I've got a shit ton of NES games. But we'll go over here where I just pretty much select the game that I am looking to try to play, which we'll say the original Tech Mobile, we'll say I downloaded it, double click it, and voila, it's playing. Now how you want to set up your controller is you want to go to options and you want to go to input. Now depending on what type of controller you're using, all you'll do is select the controller that you are using here and then you will double click on these and you will hit the corresponding button on your controller to match all of these like left up right down select start and your B and A buttons because of course this is Nintendo those are the only buttons you're gonna have to use and then after that you're all set and you're ready to play We'll get, give you all a little taste of some Bo Jackson here right quick. The original Bo Jackson, I might say. Now, I hope Jerry Tolley is uh, going to watch this. Because this mainly is for him. He's the one who asked for me to do this. It's the original Tech Mobile. Get the fuck off me. <laughs> Get the fuck off me. Look at Tim Brown go, baby! I almost returned that shit back to the house. You already know who we're giving the ball to. It's motherfucking Bo Jackson, and look at how fast he is in this game. <laughs> you can't even touch him, he knocks your ass. <laughs> good shit, good shit. So, if you do want some of the games that I have, and after you get the uh, after you get the emulator, just hit me up, man, and I'll send you a zipped file of all my games for the NES. I've got a shit ton of them. Ready, down. Let's see, where's nope? Oh, there's Howie Long. Got his ass. <laughs> Ready, down. Hunt, hunt, hunt. Get him, Howie. Let's see if I can Ready, stop down. him here. Hunt, 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 hunt. But the great thing I always liked about this game is anybody can pick the ball off, even Howie Long. Hey, I picked that play. Ready, down. Hunt, 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 hunt. Picked off Howie Long. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that's how you do it, man. If you have any questions, just please get a hold of me and let me know. You know what I mean? But then it's techmobile.org, and it's where you can get the game. Now, where you can find the original game, Tecmo Super Bowl, uh, you'll go under Tecmo Super Bowl NES. Here is the original Tecmo Super Bowl. Now, there's also one that we use right here. This is the 32-team original TSB ROM. Now, these this ROM here is for uh, all the editing. We'll use this ROM to edit to get uh, our newer age ROMs. You know what I'm saying? And then this one right here is the original. This is the one uh, where you got, you know, just pretty much your standard 28 teams, which is what it was back in the day. Now, you can also go to your miscellaneous ROMs. They have Tecmo Super Bowl NCAA, USFL 88, SEC vs. Big Ten Legends, Tecmo Super XFL. You know what I mean? So they've got the XFL in here as well, and it's all Tecmo Super Bowl. It's just, you know, pretty much edited. And then if you're into editing the game yourself, 
I can show you how to do that as well under editors, tools, and miscellaneous. TSB Tool Supreme is your end-all, be-all tool for this game. You can edit schedules. You can edit rosters. You can edit playbooks. You can edit every single solitary thing in the game that doesn't have to do really with the hacks, like adding two-point conversions, things like that. Now, um, there is no editor, I don't believe, for editing uh, like uh, the cheats and the hacks in the game. If there is, uh, I don't have access to them. You'll have to talk to somebody on this website, which BrewDog is a real big one to speak to. That dude is a hacking and modding genius. This dude has added so much to this game to make it so close to realistic nowadays style football it hurts. So I would suggest hitting him up if you're looking to modify your game in any way. You know, anything like that. But in order to start modifying your game, you need this TSB Tool Supreme. This is how I add players who were not in the start of the ROM at first. Like how I added Trey Tucker just within this last week. This is the tool that I did it with. And how I changed Max Crosby's color. This was the tool I did it with. So, you know, kind of just to let you know that's pretty much how it works. You know what I mean? And you download that, and it's pretty much the same thing. When you download it, it'll go straight into your downloads folder, and it comes right up. You want the 1.3.0 beta version. It is the latest version, and it's the most up-to-date, so it'll work. Now, of course, I'm running Windows 10, so you're going to want to get the corresponding download for your corresponding Windows, whatever version you're running. You know what I mean? But anyway, that's relatively it. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell for notifications for more classic gaming content, hacks, mods, and teaching you pretty much on how to do all the same things that I'm doing right here on Abacab Classic Gaming, where we encourage that if you're going to game, keep it classic, and I'll catch you all later, man. As a matter of fact, let me jump on over here to the chat because I ain't even seen who's all in here yet. It's just Richard Lyon, but yeah, definitely, bro. Uh... The kid is going to light up the Bears if he plays, in my opinion. you got to be talking about Aiden O'Connell. Yeah, I understand that, man. We'll save that for the Raider critique. We'll be fucking doing a post-game video, more than likely on Tuesday, to where we're not in the way. And uh, go ahead and stay tuned, because I'm going to come right back on the shuttle and start playing some NFL 2K24. And then, you know, I promised to get this video out of the way. I wanted uh, Jerry Tolley to be able to uh, download this or anybody else who wants to go in and download and play some old school Tecmo Super Bowl, dude. And this is how I do it. And this is pretty much how y'all need to do it, too. So I'm going to go ahead and get on out of here, man. You guys have a good day. And uh, we'll see you again on the next video.